A young woman who ran away from Alabama to marry an ISIS fighter lost around in federal court today. Hoda Muthana wants to come back to the U.S. The State Department has blocked her return. Charlie Daggett spoke with her in Syria. Any hope that Hoda Muthana and her infant son might be fast-tracked back to America vanished today in a Washington, D.C. courtroom. The, the question on this is a constitutional question, the rights of any U.S. citizen. Uh, and a U.S. citizen doesn't forfeit that by committing a criminal act. And today, the Justice Department doubled down on the government's claim that she is not a U.S. citizen. But when we spoke with her, she was adamant. I know I am an American citizen, and I know I have the right to come back. I have no other citizenship anywhere. The President of the United States himself said that you're not welcome back to America. What would you say to him? I would tell him to study the legal system, <laughs> because uh, apparently I am allowed back. I have papers. I have citizenship. But while the courts decide her citizenship status, Muthana told us she now has deep regrets about what she did. I would never support any of this, which I wish I could tell the people that I'm not a threat to America. I hope no one sees me as a threat, and I hope everyone uh, gives me a second chance, basically. What do you miss most about the United States? I, I miss my family. I miss comfort. I miss uh, security. I miss my freedoms, really. I miss having the choice to do what I want, not being forced to do whatever ISIS wants me to do. Everything Hoda Muthana left behind to come here is all she's hoping to get back now. Charlie Daggett of CBS News in Northern Syria.